It's time for the One Bar and Lepica Show, bringing you anything and everything Minnesota Vikings. Welcome to professional football. All right, welcome back to the One Bar and Lepagus show. I am One Bar with Lepagus. Big news, big news. Did it. No, wait, that's for the Super Bowl. Don't, oh, don't crack you're right, it. You're right. Delvin Cook, baby, he is staying in purple. Huge extension. The Vikings and Cook get it done. Uh, this is huge. So it's a, it's a five-year, $63 million deal, 28 guaranteed. Uh, what are your, what, what's your immediate thoughts when you saw this news and heard it? Well, First off, very excited that Alvin Cook is here to stay. I mean, I've been I've been kind of bouncing back and forth whether they pay him or not, but for twelve point five million a year, um, I think that's a damn steal. Dalvin Cook is a top three running back in this in in the league, and he is what the, like the sixth highest paid running back. So that is a freaking bargain. Yeah, and you look. I mean, look again. Not just having Delvin Cook, you got to give Rob Brzezinski credit again for making this shit work. Um, how we can keep signing these guys is just. I don't know where he's finding the money. And I don't give a shit. Uh, he's getting her done. But yeah, having Delvin Cook here now for the next five years um, gives you stability at the running back position. It, it also just shows how great this team is at keeping their homegrown talent. I mean, these are players they drafted that they're extending. Up, you know, going out and signing all these big guys. Uh, this is this is the talent they brought up and have grown here in Minnesota, and, and they're keeping in Minnesota, so it's huge. And another big thing just for this season, immediate impact, now this situation isn't going to be lingering over their heads every single game. You know, if this would have carried on the season, things would have started getting bad. Um, you know damn well every press conference would be something about, is Delvin Cook going to be here next year? Does he want to be here? It, it could have gotten ugly, so this eliminates that whole worry. Um, the only thing we got to worry about now is how – Freaking awesome our run game is going to be every day. Yeah, I mean, and hats off to Dalvin Cook. This dude showed up to camp. Yes, there was a little bit of rumblings beforehand, but he was a true professional, showed up, did his work, got paid. I mean, so Alvin Kamara just signed to. Alvin Kamara is getting $15 million a year. Um, when you look at guys that are ahead of him, McCaffrey, obviously, Zeke, Kamara, Le'Veon Bell is getting paid more than him this year, and David Johnson. So it's, it's a straight up. I, I just think it's a steal. I mean, I thought when they were going to resign him, it was going to be in the fourteen to fifteen million dollars a year. Well, you also got to remember though, Delvin Cook has not yet put together a sixteen game season, so there's got to be a little bit of a, you know, a recourse for that, which I think maybe that twelve point five reflects that a little bit. Um, a lot of those guys you mentioned have, you know, have put together full seasons, have carried the load. Yeah, and every older than game. balls. I'm just saying they've done it. So uh, Cook hasn't at this point. Uh, hopefully this is a start where, uh, you know, this five-year deal, let's hope uh, at least, you know, three of these he plays 16 games. Yeah, and with running backs, I mean, Dalvin Cook is 25 years older right now. He just turned 25 in August. So still young, but for five years, I mean, we'll see if he even makes it through the whole contract. We, we often see running backs maybe not get to the end of that contract, but we'll see. Yeah, and if, if he does, I mean, this is a chance for him to really make his legacy – and secure it in Minnesota. I mean, if he's the back for the next five years, starting every game, uh, he, his name's going to be right up there with the best rushers in, in the team history. So uh, what an opportunity for him, not just to, you know, make his name known league-wide, but, I mean, to really solidify himself as an all-time Viking great running back. Yes, and we got this guy in round two, which is just silly, silly, silly talk. Career stats, he's got 2,100 rushing yards, average 4.6 yards a carry, um, and we know he is – very, very good in the past game. Yeah, so um, it's huge. So you got, even if, you know, your quarterback changes here in the next couple of years, you know you're going to have your running game intact. So you're always going to have that strong portion, which I think is huge. Um, who knows? Maybe the Vikings end up taking a, a quarterback high. At least that quarterback coming in will have a strong running game to, uh, to help them out. Well, and the young nucleus of this offense, now we got Dalvin Cook, we got Herb Smith, we got Justin Jefferson, we got some young right. pieces on the line. So uh, very, very good to just get this locked up. Don't have to worry about it. And we still got Alexander Madison. Let's not forget about him as far as this deadly running back combo. Yeah, so it's it's uh, this is huge. It's just a great move all around. Uh, nothing but applause and smiles for me. Yeah, 12.5 million. Jeez. Steal. Yeah. It's huge. It's huge. So, uh, yeah, Delvin Cook sticking around, staying in purple for five years. Hell yes. I think this uh, gives the one bar and Lopagus seal of approval. Oh, you're damn right. And he's going to come out tomorrow. Just, he's really going to 
reward Brzezinski and, and Spielman and everybody with a good 160-yard rushing attack. And 80 receiving yards. Wow. Wow, that's great. Right. Yeah, that is greedy. But this is something that is not greedy. It's a horrible segue. But hot and, water, hot and cold water sound different when poured into a glass. And so does beer. <laughs>